Then we rely on the help of others to clear our path. Our priority is holding this path. Hey, Commander, over here. Time to make some noise. What? I've been looking forward to meeting you, Commander. I told Traherne I needed the big guns for this mission, and here you are. <laughs> Welcome to the party. Demolition is serious work, soldier. But there's nothing wrong with enjoying your work. So, what are we lighting up today? That's the spirit. Like I always tell my wife, Sira, any lump can hack bad guys to death, but it takes skill and style to turn them into craters and dust. Our preliminary targets are three Orient Towers that are flooding the region with undead nasties. We can't hold this area until we stop the influx. I'll handle the explosives. Your job is to get me to the targets and keep the enemy off me while I plant the charges. Then we drop back, settle in, and enjoy this spectacle pyrotechnical. I love char-conditioned animals. Nothing phases them. Explosions, massacres, rude language. Every member of the legions is trained for war, from a paradis motor down to the lowliest pack animal. Easy there, Iron Pants. I meant it as a compliment. Battle awaits. do some real damage. Clear. This baby's ready to blow. Whoa! Still got all your limbs? Excellent. Come on, more towers await us. Yeah. 
Feel the fury! Secondary target acquired! <laughs> I love this military talk. It makes blowing stuff up sound so classy. Feel the fury! The fuse is lit. Not literally, of course, but there's another tower. But we have to go through the cave to get there. Let's go! Leave it here. Almost done. One more bomb, and then we do the dance of explosive cure. Now that's a fireworks show. That was only a warm-up, though. Things are about to get really interesting. The next target is a huge Orient bone ship that's polluting the waters of the Meyer Sea. It's a big job. If we use normal explosives, we'd need to fill the ship's hold with them just to make a dent. Very impractical. That hulk is going to require some serious flash and bang. I've got a line on two high-performance combustibles we can use. Since you outrank me, let me defer to your choice of explosives. We'll send that tub to the bottom of the sea. I'll give you a full briefing when you're ready. Welcome.
Hope you're ready for bad news. I just learned from Zop here that his whole team went ashes and embers on him. Hey, that's my crew you're talking about. They're going to be extremely hard to replace. Sorry, I tend to get over-focused when I'm on a mission. Tell us what happened. We were completing the extraction when Max's suit malfunctioned. He burst into flames and dropped the flame core device. Then lava elementals attacked us. We withdrew hastily. If you want our flame core, you'll need one of these special golem rigs. Without them, you won't last 30 seconds. We need that core. It's the heart of the explosive device I want to build. All right, Commander, suit up. It's about to get real, real hot. Elementals everywhere. But Zop made these rigs especially for this job. We should be safe enough. Temperature readings are off the charts. Don't worry, the suits can take it. Wait, don't touch that. It requires special handling. I got what we came for. Temperature readings are off the charts, but we're safe inside these rigs. Wait, suit malfunction. The core's magnetic field is mucking with my motivators. I can't move. I can fix it, but oh glitch, there's a huge spike in the energy readings. Something big is coming out of the volcano, and I don't think it's coming to thank us. This is bad. I can't ditch my suit or I'll be crispified. You'll have to fight that thing alone. Hang on. I'm detecting massive power surges from those flaming orbs. That's probably what's giving it cohesion. Take them out and that thing will disperse. that thing is really making it mad. Scratch one giant elemental, and I'm free! Let's get what we came for and saunter on out of here. I expected things to get hot, but not that hot. Thanks for bailing me out. Just watching my partner's back, and giving him the chance to collect the flame core. You got it, right? Oh, I got it. 
This is just what we need to send that bone ship straight to the bottom of the Meyer Sea. Then I'll meet you there as soon as I've finished prepping the device. I'll have to introduce you to Sarah. You'd like her. She's a pack soldier too. A medic. That's why we make such a great pair. I blow up enemies, she patches up allies. Excelsior! Ready when you are, Ton. After all we went through to get this, I can't wait to see it explode. Then you're in for a treat. We have an unobstructed view of the target from here. Now we simply need to plant the bomb, get clear, and flip the switch. Not that simple means easy. Floating mines surround the ship, the waters are thick with undead sharks, and... we're in crate territory. These packed soldiers are here to help protect the detonator, but you and I still have to do all the heavy lifting. Or, to be accurate, the heavy swimming. Let's hit the water. The sooner we're done splashing around, the sooner we see that bone ship go boom. Halo delivered. Now let's paddle ourselves out of here on the double. Hold on to your ears, everyone. This is going to be my masterpiece. Wait, something's wrong. The detonator is showing red. The connections were perfect. Something must be knocked out of position. Sir, we have crate inbound. Closing fast. And they look like they mean business. All right, I'll reset the charges on the ship. You keep the crate off the detonator. 
I don't like leaving you unprotected. Between the crate and the sharks. I can handle the cartilaginous cretins that are still out there. And the crate are focused on this position. They won't even notice me. That ship has to go down. I'll signal when the bomb is ready and I'm clear. When the detonator goes green, throw the switch and enjoy the show. Hold this position much longer. Set off the charges now. May Balthazar strengthen you. Should have been back by now. Let's swim out there and see if we can spot it. something by the gods it's Tan. he's dead i was sure he signaled us was the explosion bigger than he expected we have to report this you head back to shore i'll bring in Tan. Commander, good to see you. Marshal Treherne is waiting for you. The crate orb we recovered is fascinating. Oh, it literally prevents the dead from rising again. Then I wish we had a hundred of them. How does this work? Can we replicate it? Not so far. The only thing we know for sure is that it's steeped in powerful magic. As long as it works, we can figure out why it works when the war is over. Titan's forces are coming. Why aren't the Asura gates functional? I'm sorry, Marshal. We can't seem to isolate the problem. It could be our proximity to ore. Or maybe we've got a saboteur. This is critical. Without those gates, we're cut off from any reinforcements. Greetings, Commander. I was sorry to hear about Ton. He was a huge asset, and much admired. Thank you, sir. The mission was a success, but that's small comfort for his loved ones, or me. Ton was my partner, so I take full responsibility. That said, I see you've done well. Fort Trinity is certainly formidable, and from all the activity, I'd say it's growing even stronger. It better be. We've seen a huge increase in undead activity while we've been constructing our defenses. I believe a major attack is imminent. All the signs are there. Our outermost defensives have suffered a series of probing attacks, and we've lost several long-range scouts. We recovered a powerful magical orb from the depths, and we have Ton's best explosives. 
but there have been some disturbing glitches in communication. Fort Trinity is not yet secure. Worst of all, our Asura gates are not functioning, and nobody can tell me why. Magical or mechanical failure, saboteurs, it's all very disturbing. I want you to double-check our defenses, starting with the lumber camp. They've lost a lot of workers, and we need that timber. You take point. We're behind schedule. Traherne needs more lumber to strengthen our fortifications. The last logging party we sent out is still missing. We have no idea what happened to them. Until we do, we can't risk sending any more. All right. Organize a search party to find the missing loggers. Once we find... We need to get fool. back to the gate. Fort Trinity is in danger. Leave us and seal that gate. Mm -hmm. Pull both switches to seal the gate. Mother, forgive me. Get those cannons firing! Oh, 
Time to do some real damage. <laughs> Back to the gate. Cannons are destroyed. We're defenseless. Mother, forgive me. Feel the fury! Run, miscreant! No time to lose. We need to secure the underwater gate. to get through. I've got all the firepower you need. Ton made these bombs, and he's one of the best. Your pact is finished! Your orb, your fortress, and your Asura gates belong to us! Keep them away from me! You didn't think you'd mess with Chuck, did you? Leave the rest to us! Storms! 
field of fury! One hundred years, all has been lost. Despoiled, corrupted, ruined by the presence of a dragon, an infection withering the heart of Tyria. Fort Trinity symbolizes our determination. It stands as a mark of our unity against the dragons. From here, we will prevail. We will fight to rend the darkness with steel and flame always looking toward the door. Our victory at Fort Trinity will show the world that we can strike against the dragons. When we are ready, we will prove that even in the Sanctum of Awe, they are not untouchable. We can reach the dragon's lair in the heart of Awe. We can assault Arar. We can destroy Zaitan before the dragon's infection claims us all. This battle is over. We can triumph. But the war has just begun. I'm glad we have the dragon's attention. I want Zaitan to know the names and faces of those who will defeat it. From the size of the assault force it sent here, I'd say the dragon has taken notice, sir. However, the situation seems stable for now. If you don't mind, I need to find Tan's widow, and personally deliver the bad news. Of course. I had Tan's personal effects sent here. There's a locket that could be a family heirloom. I'm sure his wife would appreciate its return. It's not much, but we have to honor our fallen as best we can. The war and I will be waiting when you return. was I out? I was triaging them when something hit me. Hard! Come on! Stick with me while I see to the rest of our wounded. I don't fancy another concussion. We're too late. This one's already gone. Here's a live one. Open your eyes, soldier. 
You'll be all right if you can stay conscious. On your feet, soldier. You'll live. Nothing I can do for this one, either. Are there any packed troops left alive? You're lucky to be alive. Come on, get up. Never had a chance, poor kid. Dead before she hit the ground. Sira, I'm here with bad news about Ton. I was with him on a demolition mission. Unfortunately, he did not survive. Ton's gone? That can't be. He promised me we'd both live through this. What happened? Tell me how he died. We rigged an Orion bone ship to blow, but the explosives wouldn't go off. Ton went back to fix them. He died to save the mission. Is that supposed to make me feel better? The war can go on without Ton, but I can't. How could you let this happen? You murdered my husband, you and your pact. Get away from me! Just get away! Get away from me, you murderer! Ton, I'll find you! I swear it! Ah! No! Somebody! Just anyone! Feel the no! Ah, someplace new. Sira, please. You have to return to camp. If you want to honor Tan, you have to live. Don't die just so you can be with him. I know he loved you madly. You were all he talked about. You and the life he wanted you both to have. Life? What life? What do you know about him or me? Just leave me alone. Wait. What about his mother's locket? He wanted me to have it. It was all she had when she died. And now it's all I have left to remember him. You saved my life. I thank you for that. But I will never, ever forgive you for taking Tan from me. Just leave. I'll find my own way back. Too long, Tyria has suffered. We gather now with newfound purpose. Zaitan's servants storm our homelands. It is time to bring the battle back to Or. This tide will wash over Ara and cleanse the dragon's corruption. Together, we will prevail. Let the ship sail. Let the troops march. And let us find victory! A stirring speech to her. <laughs> Absolutely. You've turned into a real war leader, Marshal. Now if we can just keep the impetus you started, then we'll have a chance. Thank you, friends. May fortune bless you. <laughs> Good to see you. Let's get this briefing underway. I wanted to talk about Ton's widow, Sira. I understand she was inconsolable. Grief does terrible things to people. 
but this is war, and war manufactures grief. Ton joined the pact with open eyes. He chose a dangerous profession. He knew the risks and accepted them. Sira may never forgive you or me, but in time she will see. Ton's sacrifice helped save thousands, maybe millions of lives. He chose to die a hero, and the heroes of this war will be remembered and honored forever. There's someone I'd like you to meet. Our visitor may cause alarm, so privacy is paramount. Sire, it's now safe to reveal yourself. Greetings, Marshal Traherne. As you've requested, I've come to honor my oath. Excellent. Let's speak with the commander and give you an assignment. I'm pleased you're here. Thank you for your patience, Commander. Allow me to introduce the revered Sire Al-Rajid. In the name of the Concordat of the Tetios Houses, I greet you, ally of my ally. It's an honor, Sire. I've heard that your people don't meet with land dwellers. You speak truth. I have long owed Treven. Now at last he has called upon me to honor my oath. Scouts have discovered a sixth temple in Or, a lost shrine to a fallen god hidden underwater in the Strait of Malediction. Abaddon, the human god of secrets, was cast out of Ara by the other deities, and his name was erased from history. Very little remained. Zaitan craves something inside that temple, so we must get there first. Sire will accompany you as a guide. Tell me, Commander, can you fight? Is your oath made of steel? You'll need all your skills to travel with me. I have yet to meet anything I couldn't overcome. Intriguing. I look forward to this, Commander. Until then, may your steps be relentless. I'm pleased you're here. <laughs> 